Well, welcome everybody to a part of the world where football really matters. There is a healthy tension, great expectation building in the lead up to kickoff here. A little bit grey overhead, and indeed the forecast is for a drop or two of rain as the day grows older. But regardless of that, there is a lovely backdrop here. The ambience is good, smashing noise from both sets of supporters, and expectations high in both camps. So what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game. The action has already started. Well read, he sorted that out. Big chance! Oh, denied brilliantly! Oh, that's a sparkling save, absolutely sparkling. His reflexes work ultra-sharp. Gets it back. Chooses to go back. Plays it out to the flank. Tries a shot! Good movement there, but not the best of finishes. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Well, there's a lot of movement out wide now. Yeah, you can certainly see that. Well, I think it's a move to open the game up more, whether out wide or, or just getting a runner through the middle now. There's a long ball, cut out in the nick of time. Yet another to add to football's endless list of could-haves and should-haves. Look, the game is full of ifs and buts. If only the, the pass could have completed its journey. And here's Dermic. And the half-time whistle goes. So now the team has broken through. But certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now. But still goals. Interesting half, just missing goals. So don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil nil. And we're already back underway here. Tight old game so far. And that change has a pop! And it's a goal! And as soon as they made that error in midfield, they didn't have time to react before the ball hit the net. Very much a lesson learned. When the manager called on him, he was only too happy to repay that faith. That's how you make an impact as a sub. You know, when most are tiring, you can impose a freshness and energy to best effect. What an introduction. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Well, listen, a few words of advice and encouragement. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Well, the referee has made it pretty clear now that this is his last chance. Well, he knew what he was taking on there, Peter, and special delivery from the ref. Cross deflected behind for a corner. Besic plays it forward. And no, that is pretty much the end of that. Battles to win it back. Look at the way that back line is, is coming under serious pressure. High pressing that's being applied with real pace too. Quite, you got it. One straight pass, that might be all they need here. And he's away. A well played. He's taken that really cleanly. He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. Into the last quarter of an hour. He's gone for it! A real chance and a real let-off. If he sacrifices some power, he may control the elevation. We have got changes here from both sides, in fact. 
hoists it forward. Jack Yelka. Time is ebbing away, but it feels like an eternity when you're holding on to a slender lead. Chance! And yes, it's there! And surely that clinches it! There really is no way back now! A truly wonderful strike, decorated with dip and curl. Yeah, and it's not a surprise to see him elect to shoot from there, considering how much movement can be generated on the ball. Great hit. So that's two now without reply. Played out to the right. A real chance to break. Four added mitts on the board. And that is it, the referee has seen enough. So they bask in their win, a genuinely professional performance and a result which is well-deserved. Could you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? There's a solidity about them. most people have now got through the turnstiles and are well covered up against the elements whatever they may throw at us over the next hour or two well this really is a great venue it adds so much character to every game it stages the action has already started Jim who do you reckon is pivotal yeah and Golo Kante he is only one midfielder, but it often feels like he does the work of two or three. He's got exceptional awareness for danger and the stamina to make sure he can go and, and snuff it out over and over again if required. He's also exceptional in the tackle. And when you watch him in the latter parts of a game, 90th minute plus, he looks as if he's in the first five. Yeah, I'd have picked him to no doubt the fans feel much the same way. Going for goal! And he 
just whacks it away. Chelsea are having a tough week. It is a crazy schedule for them. Yeah, it's a tough spell, and guarding against fatigue for the players is key now. Tiredness can be the blame for more injuries, so it's an opportunity for the manager to shuffle his pack. A wonderful effort all by himself. Well, the run was really impressive, the finish was depressive, and expectations were not met. Chelsea are very much in free-scoring form of late, goals in each of their last five games. Aimed in towards the centre. Oh, well defended, that had to be done. Marcos Alonso plays it forward. hudson Otoy. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Goes for goal! Goal! Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. Chelsea keep the ball but can't do anything meaningful with it. And there's the end of the first half. So there you have it, a close sport half of football, but one that still had its moments, and ultimately produced just one goal. A decent game up to now. Well, they showed glimpses of some wonderful football to groom with the lead at half-time, and that's definitely pleased the fans. I think they'll be looking to keep this intensity up now in the second half. Leading a cagey game here, it's had its moments, and it's 1-0. Hits one! That's got a rattle. Marcos Alonso. And here's Giroud. Jack Yelka. Being still separated by the game's only goal. Come loose. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Good running with the ball. Can they build on it? He's had a shot. And for a moment, time stood still. That's what all good teams do these days. Pressing from the front is highly effective. Christensen goes looking. Forward it goes. Hudson Adoy not easily shrugged off the ball. And he's on his way. Real chance. Really well taken goal. This is getting better and better. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. That was all very well drilled. So that's two now without reply. Well, with this kind of authority, Peter, why not push on and, and totally kill this off? And it's Aspilicueta. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. Tries to get it forward quickly. Well played, he saw that coming. Decent looking ball. Shot at goal! They are rampant! 
And the lead is three. It is surely done. Really outwitted one-on-one. -on -one. Once more, he gets the better of the keeper. Yeah, that's brilliant from him. Such a, a calm finish. Just pick your spot, don't think about what the keeper's going to do. Concentrate on what you have to do. He's made it three. Quite a day at the office for him. Oh, he's been unstoppable in this match. Every single time he's been in possession, he's looked a threat. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. Marcos Alonso. And time is up. Oh, a great day for attacking football. The artists have painted their pretty pictures. Only one team in it. And after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? Of course, we all love to watch the creative side of the game and goal scorers, but there's an art to good defence too, and their organisation and discipline has helped earn this win. So that's it from us. Many thanks go to Jim Beglin, and goodbye from us.